guys? So in today's video, we take a little bit of a review on the camp skins. So I just wrapped my Sony a7 II and I just want to do a little bit of a review on it, my thoughts on it, and a little bit about the process of the installation. So let's get into it. So when it arrives, it comes with obviously your cam skin and this little seat where it gives you a few things, uh, a, little bit, a little bit about the skin. And you just scan the QR code and it'll bring up onto your website and you just select your camera and from there if you can see it it shows which images it shows the images and which stickers where they line up and stuff and just give you a little bit of a guide of where to put the pieces together and stuff and on mine i didn't use all of them because i just like having this handle here how it is as well as this part right here for my thumb and that's what i did on the last one because i actually got one at the end of 2020 but on my first installation, I'll be honest, I didn't install it as good and I had a lot of like, um, a lot of the corners were starting to peel off and stuff and a lot of, uh, what do you call it? A lot of like smudges and um, like a lot of creasing as well. That was the main thing. I cre had a lot of creases in my uh, first installation and I knew what I did wrong so I didn't have a, um, a hair dryer or a tool to, sorry, where did I put that? Oh. I didn't have any little tool to kind of just get around the little corners and stuff. And I, this is just like a little sewing needle because especially some of these corners around here, along the buttons and on the front as well, you really want to just kind of get in there on the corners. Because if not, then it'll start to peel and that's what I didn't do on the first installation. So that's what, if you're going to get one, you should do for sure. Now for the installation part itself, I personally, I'll be honest, um, I'm not the best with installing these. I struggled a lot in the first one. I did better on this one because I had a little bit of experience with before, but still, I think I did not that bad as you can see here. Did pretty good on there. There's like very slight creases and stuff. And overall, I'm still really happy with it. It looks great, great in my hand and it's gonna look really nice during photo shoots and even on display just on my shelf over there with all my lenses and gear. But I definitely recommend checking these out. They're really cool. And I think they're honestly worth it. I also recommended having a clean surface, so I kind of wiped down my desk, make sure it was nice and clean. And also the camera, so I used a baby wipe along the camera. Obviously stay away from the um, lens sensor. I stayed away from uh, quick view finder and things of just that nature, but mainly you can just go along the body of it. And, Cause I had a lot of, a lot of just dust build up and just whatever was on it. And, and that's really just make sure it stays and stuff, but yeah, just that's just the biggest thing I can say for it. But honest thoughts, I really enjoy it. I think it looks really cool in my hand. And yeah, I think it's worth it. So if you guys want to check it out, link is in description. Make sure to follow them on Instagram and TikTok and I think Facebook as well. And yeah, be sure to check them out. If you guys want to save a little bit of discount, uh, there's a link in the description. And yeah, if you guys did all enjoy this cam skins, breakdown review slash a little bit of behind the scenes of the installation process be sure to drop a like subscribe and comment down below other types of photography videos you like to see and yeah see you guys later